so first of all the bag you want to use half part of that bag you face it on a plain surface you place it on a plain surface and you take your tape and measure the length so i'm having nine i'm having six so what i'm going to be doing here is to make sure that you write down your measurement the length is nine the breadth is six so nine plus nine is 18 and six plus six is 12. now you're going to be measuring measuring 12 because i'm going to be using it for the both sides of the bag so i'm going to measure 12. okay so here over here i have 18 and the breadth i have 12 so i'm not sure you can see the pen so if you have something that is going to help you to see the color very well like my i already know where i placed it so here i can see my pen and i'll just put my scissors and cut So this is what I cut out and I'm going to be cutting it into equal parts. So now let me go ahead and cut it into equal parts. Take your fishing line pass your fishing line through the hole of this your needle so when you're satisfied with the length of your fishing line you go ahead and cut set the fishing line aside now join the two ends of the fishing line together it's a little bit difficult to knot but just try knot it as if you're knotting your thread and it's voila so easy i don't know if you can see my knots okay so sorry guys what i did was look at over here now this particular bead at the middle this black one this one here i passed my needle through it pass this needle over here and it came out from the next place and i pulled it so after that I passed in my needle through this material. So this material is very light and I'm going to be managing it because the texture is very light. I just needed a very light thing since there's no much hole on the bead. So now let me just repeat what I did before. This needle has to go through. Instead of going through this next bead being the white one, I'm going to be passing it through this other white one. So, pull my needle and so it has when you're using a bigger bead this needle is okay for it the sewing needle is okay for it so i'll go ahead and 
so now i'm going to be pass i'm going to jump one bead i'm going to jump this white bead and go through the black bead i'll jump one bead go through the next bead that is what i'll keep on doing jump a bead and go through the next one the next one is this black passing my needle so guys i had no choice and let's continue with my big needle because i couldn't find the small one but if you're doing this she's a small one. so i've been struggling so far so good and i've gotten to this extent so i continued with the same pattern skip a bead pass through the next bead and i've been struggling with this 